Crossroads serves as a call to all who care about the virtues, spirit, and energy of St. Andrews. It is a campaign built on the eternal verities of liberal education. We have always known that an education to prepare students for life must teach the discipline of hard work, persistence, and tenacity. Our graduates need to know how to commit themselves to audacious goals and persistent commitment towards the achievement of those ends. As a school dedicated to the tradition of amateur athletics, St. Andrews envisioned a field house and new and renovated squash and tennis facilities as appropriate classrooms for an education for character and resilience. St. Andrews has celebrated the power of versatile, passionate, and inspiring teaching throughout our history. Recent research suggests that a great teacher is the single most important factor for student achievement at the private and public level. The power of the St. Andrews educational paradigm depends on the generosity, humanity, dedication, and skill of a versatile faculty. Crossroads honors that tradition by funding programs designed to enable St. Andrews teachers to lead in their fields, to influence and inspire educational innovation throughout the public and private school world. Teachers, students, and staff members choose St. Andrews as their place of vocation or education because the school is open to all, regardless of means. This historic tradition and commitment make the school's energy, diversity, and ambition possible. Our financial aid program creates the culture, the community that best prepares students for lives in a democracy and global world. Being a little biased, I believe athletics is a great place to learn life lessons. I believe there's no better place because when you leave St. Andrews, you're going to be a part of some team somewhere. You're going to work with a team of people. So you have to be respectful. You have to be accountable because somebody somewhere down the line, even if it's your family and your household, somebody's counting on you. Specifically things like in the job that I do right now in the intensive care unit, I coordinate our movements and orchestrate what we are doing as a team with nurses, doctors, respiratory therapists, and like it was on the basketball court, those things have to change very dynamically, moment to moment. And so knowing your teammates and knowing you can depend on them is incredibly important. And those are things that I figured out on the ball fields at St. Andrews. You can never do anything uh, by yourself in life or e even in sport. Camaraderie, hard work, togetherness, support, all these things you get from sports but can also translate into a business or you know, any other profession. I think sports at St. Andrews is important. Um, I feel like it's also a privilege. A good coach teaches lessons about the game. A great coach teaches lessons about life. I think at St. Andrews, a lot of what we do is trying to teach them how to be good citizens. And I don't think that athletics is in any way um, divided from that. Well, the thing that I found most interesting was the philosophy espoused by Waldy Powell, our headmaster, was that you get uh, knocked down and you realize after it happens a number of times that you can get up and go forward. This, of course, is a, it's a lesson that carries forward uh, throughout life. In the long run, that's what's gonna be important to a student afterwards. It's how they interact with people and treat people and uh, respond to difficult situations. And hopefully that's what we teach across the board. I always tell players, you know what my championship is? When you go to college, and you come back and you visit and you give back and you tell them about your life experiences and you tell them some of the things you learned here from us, that's our championship. Developing Student athletes uh, it requires um, resources. The fact that the Sprell Fieldhouse is now available to the students provides another level of opportunity. 
the Soprell Field House is going to embellish the life of every child on this campus. The kids for years have put up with, you know, basically one gym with a little backup gym. Every winter sport was squeezed into a facility that was totally inadequate. This facility gives them the opportunity to have their own space to do a workout together and to do it with the proper equipment. Just, you just look at the field house and, and you have so much pride. I have so much pride. The field house will help students play at their best. It will help them aspire to want to play even better. When there's a facility of that magnitude in a high school, I believe the dream is bigger because you know that you have the best. A school is really built on the care and compassion of those that are leading it and those that are teaching the students. The faculty is, is so rich here. They give just 110% all the time. They need to be able to pull away and enrich themselves, whether that's a sabbatical year or a summer program. The incredible opportunity that the faculty have here from alumni, trustees, the endowment to continue their professional growth during the summertime at master's programs, at conferences, creating new courses, going to foreign countries. Everybody benefits from faculty enrichment because the faculty are excited, they're energized, they're dynamic, they're exploring their own favorite subject matter, you know, whatever it is, and um, they get to pass that on to the students. There are, there are teachers here who, I'm, who I have friendships with who have never taught me in a classroom or lived on my dorm, and it's because they genuinely care how each member of the community is doing. Having the kind of people that just want to continue to improve not only their skill set and their knowledge base, but their ability, I mean, to inspire others to learn. You know, what else would you be looking for um, in an education? St. Andrews has been a need-blind school forever, and thanks to the endowment that we have and the campaigns that we've had over the years, we've been able to continue this, and not a lot of schools can do this now. The community and, and spirit of St. Andrews that I know uh, would not be possible without the strong endowment uh, that we had. I mean, it, it helped me personally, and I know it helps a ton of the other students. The school did extend that gift to me, and I went on a, a maximum uh, scholarship. And uh, for that, I am forever grateful. The opportunity to come to St. Andrews has opened every door for me that, I, uh, that is open for me right now. And so I really owe every experience I have had here and everything I've learned to the fact that there are people out there who are willing to fund this place and, and to make it possible for the things that happen here to happen. That gift that is given to us it just makes this place so much more special. Just gave me an opportunity to experience different cultures, different people in a way that has helped me beyond St. Andrews. The great legacy of this school is that it was started by someone who saw a need for a different type of education. The legacy that we have all inherited is how do we continue that both now and in the future. Those things that we want around, not only for our children, but our children's children, um, you know, have to be maintained today. So raising funds for an institution as significant as St. Andrews um, is a really important thing to do. I have always prioritized giving back to St. Andrews because I fundamentally believe that whatever I give there is gonna go out into the world amplified many times over. I'm giving back something that I've received many years ago and uh, allowing someone else to have a, a like experience, and that, that's important. Well, it's our privilege to be able to help keep St. Andrews strong. We all benefited from the gifts of St. Andrews. For those of us who can give back, it's a great opportunity and a privilege. We want to thank all of the parents, all of the alum who have done, who have given anything to the school in the past and the future, and for those who are thinking about giving, thank you so much. We appreciate it as parents. Our children are eternally grateful for the opportunity. You have strengthened the tradition and the ambition of St. Andrews. 
and inspired us to be that distinctive school, the academy that excels in the art of character and leadership education, the institution that honors the calling of a great faculty, the school that opens its doors to the full diversity of our world. Thank you.